Now firmly established as one of York's visitor attractions, the York Maze reopened with a lunar landing theme. To celebrate the 40th anniversary of man setting foot on the moon, York Maze boss Tom Piercy dressed as an astronaut and hired in a special moon buggy. Unfortunately for Tom, though, there were technical problems, something which dogged events on Earth. Good job it didn't happen 40 years ago on the moon to Neil Armstrong, eh? Yeah, unfortunately we uh, we couldn't get the moon buggy to work. I think it had a bit of moon dust in the engine today, and uh, the last time it was working, obviously was. <laughs> <laughs> well, never mind about that. What's new at the maze this year then? Uh, we've got lots of new things. Obviously, the maze has got a whole new theme to it, uh, which is based around the moon landings and the 40th anniversary of the moon landings. Uh, we've got quite a few new attractions. We've got wonderful new catering, so uh, we're, uh, we're really excited about that. We're using local produce and. Uh, and we've got an electric quad bike track this time. Just loads of things and it's a great day out. So uh, come on down, you don't need to dress like me. The highlight of the day though was the chance to take to the air in a helicopter and see the maze from above. It's been carved out into the shape of a moon, an astronaut and the words York Maze. Down below, this family from Scotland were impressed. It's really good so far, yes. I like the fact there's an ice cream stand in the, in the middle of it, and the clues, the astronaut clues, make it a bit more fun than your average maze. So the new season has started, and York Maze remains open until September the 6th. Meanwhile, this particular moon buggy is going right back to NASA. David Dunning, Press Video News at York Maze.